Hey guys, so I've just installed the OnePlus One ROM on my Nexus 5, which is the Sonata Mod 11S. And if I go here into the settings, then uh, about phone, and you can see this is the Sonata Mod 11S, and then the Android 4.4.4, which is the uh, not the latest version of the Android, probably going to replace, going to be replaced pretty soon. Then you can see if you tap on build number, you will have developer options. So, and now this software is uh, which comes with the uh, OnePlus One. So the OnePlus One phone has uh, this Xiaomi Mod 11s UI. Uh, now this is a update. This was available like four or five months ago. It's almost, but I didn't make a video about that. But now it's uh, updated, and, it, and this ROM, this is Sanjay Mod 11s, is now based on Sanjay Mod M10, which is the latest version of the Sanjay Mod. So you can see that it is extremely, extremely smooth. And uh, in terms of you know basic things, basic stuff, it is extremely uh, fine. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and everything is extremely fine. Camera, everything works. And uh, the camera is extremely great. The camera app, you know, it's changed. It's like the OnePlus One phone. You can see that you can touch to focus you can go here in the settings where you can change the size of your megapixels then you can change the quality and you can mess with the, some other options then if you go into the video mode you can change the video size from 720p and 480p and 1080p these are the options and the video quality then also if we move here move to the left again then you can see power shutter option you can uh, click the power button to take photos you can also um, you know use volume zoom you can also have a left-handed operation you can adjust some stuff there so uh, these are the settings then of course one of the best thing that I like about this camera app is that uh, when you record videos you can actually test your focus now this is something that we don't get on the Nexus 5 and the other you know Nexus 5 custom rounds but this is by default you know I can focus anything I want like this is my Note 4 here I want to focus it, I can focus it like this and uh, this is extremely great feature of course after you done uh, you can take photos and you have dedicated button uh, while on the other uh, you know Nexus 5 software like other custom ROMs you have to tap to take photos but in this way you can tap to take uh, tap to take fo uh, focus here, tap to focus and if you want to take photos while recording videos just have to press this button and then click here to stop and if you swipe to the left okay if we go air again into the camera app okay can't connect to camera this is pretty weird so this kind of stuff can happen but that is the, it is the first time that it has happened and uh, very first time but of course I might have to restart my device but uh, and again another thing that I don't like another thing that I don't like about you know this ROM here is that basically you can't really edit a photo for example if I go here into this photo and if I go into edit and you can see that I don't get the editing options because it will pop up with the error that no editor editing app has been installed uh, but you know apart from that everything works so awesome the camera you can see a little bit of errors can uh, be can happen but uh, I have to restart my device it will work again but of course it, it is extremely great uh, you know ROM for your Nexus 5 is kind of like a changed ROM you know it has, has different stuff than all the previous ROMs and uh, the browser, the every uh, every other apps are working extremely fine. Then also, if we go into the settings, then uh, uh, you can see with some basic options. Then we have the lock screen option. And then if we go here into themes, you can have a lot of themes. If you have some theme installed, like if I go into theme pack and go here, these are some of the themes that it, that are installed. If I go to this theme, and I want to apply everything lock screen fronts and everything flying and you can see now I'm running this theme and you can see the icons and extremely great now there's more like one plus one device it looks like more one plus one you can see the icons and stuff like that extremely extremely good and of course you will have some lot of quick 
options you can immediately add any option if you want by clicking here and I add camera you can have different kind of options you want to add so that is extremely extremely good so uh, some basic option display and light you can mess up with some uh, display light option the LED light options like battery light and notification light which is extremely extremely great then also we do have the performance where you can change some uh, CPU kernels and you know governor types you know kind of or down clock your device you want more battery life and and and, and also uh, extremely great ROM here extremely great ROM uh, with most of settings based on the OnePlus One phone and complete port of OnePlus One on the Nexus 5 and uh, I haven't tried any kind of kernels but it is extremely great we do have the Apollo as the default music app no problem whatsoever and uh, you know sometimes we do have the camera problems but still uh, if you restart your device uh, this will work fine and uh, Apart from that, everything works extremely fine. And as far as the battery life is concerned, battery life is also good because I'm using it for like like two or three days. And uh, I charge it, and I used it in my university. I you know listen to some songs, and then, uh, but of course the battery was still you know still has like 40 percent left um, after you know doing the, some some stuff with the device. So I'm kind of you know in short, I'm de I'm uh, satisfied with this battery life performance, and I will be using this. ROM uh, for about some times and uh, for uh, you know of course it's the latest update based on CM10 and uh, I will, I will looking forward to install more updates of this ROM when it will be available uh, so definitely do check out the uh, links in the description uh, this is a OnePlus One ROM on the Nexus 5 and if you want me to show you a tutorial of how to install this I can make a video of that but of course the link will be in the description so uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next one. Peace.